behind here. Hey, is that it? Oh, uh, I'm not sure. I don't know. I don't think so. Hey, buddy, can you help me a minute? Uh, are you talking to me? Yeah, buddy. I'm not buddy. My name is Beth. Oh, well, I'm Matt. Pleasure to meet you. Uh, nice to meet you too, but I'm kind of in a hurry. I'm on my way to a Christmas party, and I thought I'd just cut through the park here, so... Christmas, Christmas, Christmas. Is that all anyone ever talks about? You don't like Christmas, Matt? I'd like it fine if I understood it. <sighs> I'm on the search for the true Christmas. And you're looking for it here? In the park? Yeah, I know it sounds kind of silly, doesn't it? That's what I thought, but... You see, I was reading this book, and it said that Christmas lives in our parks. Christmas lives in our parks? That doesn't sound right. Can I see that book? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here. See? Right there. Mm-hmm. I think you read it wrong. This says that Christmas lives in our hearts, not our parks. Oh. Yeah. Well, that means something totally different, doesn't it? <laughs> yeah, it does. So, what does it mean? Well, I guess it's saying that Christmas isn't about decorations or parties or gifts under a tree. That it's about Jesus and the difference that he can make in our hearts. Wow. You seem to know a lot about Christmas. I guess. Your name isn't Roy, is it? No, I told you. My name is Beth. If you say so, buddy. But you seem to know about as much about Christmas as Roy does. Uh, I'm sorry. Who is this Roy? He's the guy with all the answers about Christmas. I've never heard of this all-knowing Roy before. Is he in your book, too? He is, page 452. It says, and I quote, You'll never truly understand the meaning of Christmas until you have the Roy of Christmas. And now, you're here, and I'm starting to understand. No, not the Roy of Christmas. You need the joy of Christmas. Oh. Yeah, you're not a very good speller. Joy does make a lot more sense, but I'm still confused. Well, Christmas is all about Jesus. He is God's son, and God sent him to save us. Christmas is when we celebrate the birth of Jesus here on earth. And that's really good news. Good news that can fill us with joy. The, the joy, joy of, of Christmas. Christmas. Now I get it. I'm glad. The Bible tells us that we are to have joy. That doesn't always seem possible though. Sometimes life is hard or just downright scary. But the Bible not only says we should have joy, but that we should have it in all circumstances, even when we face trials or hard times. How is that possible? The answer to that question is also the reason we celebrate Christmas. Jesus. Jesus Christ is our joy. Jesus was born as a baby. He grew up and died on a cross for our sins. He came back to life and conquered death. Now that's a reason to celebrate. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, we thank you for bringing Jesus into our world to save us from ourselves. Help us to remember the good news and have great joy always. In Jesus' name, amen. All right, friends, don't forget to check out our YouTube and Facebook pages for today's Kids Rock video. Well, now I gotta get going to my party. All right, well, have fun. Have a nice night. Thank you. Oh, and thanks for your help. Wow. That Roy. Man, he's not a nice guy.